Measure the outside of the conveyor structure and width of your belt. Verify the fitment of the cleaner on your conveyor structure. If using standoffs, add one inch per side to the overall conveyor structure width. Take out the assembly of the plate. They will come pre-assembled from the factory. Install the side plates and standoffs on each side of the conveyor structure. Use the 13 millimeter hardware included in your kit to securely fasten the components. Insert the metal shaft through the plastic bushing. Slide the reaction arms on the shaft. Verify that you have 5 to 6 inches, 125 to 150 millimeters of shaft extending past the side plate to accommodate the tension mechanism. Slide the torsion hub spring and collar on the end of the shaft. Make sure the collar is seated against the side plate. Adjust the torsion hub to maximum adjustment and inset the set bolt. Spread the reaction arms apart. Use the FGS installation gauge and verify the position of the blade against the belt. Slide the gauge on the blade support bar and make sure the top of the gauge makes contact with the belt. The correct position occurs when the gauge seats flat against the belt. Insert the blade support bar assembly inside the spline of each reaction arm. Make sure the bar is in the same position on both arms. If the bar is misaligned, cleaner performance degradation can occur. Verify that you have at least 1 inch 25 millimeters of bar past the reaction arms. Install the 13 millimeters screw and nut on the collar. Use food grade anti-seize on all threaded joints. Tighten the reaction arm nuts until seated plus one quarter of a turn. Position the blade against the belt. With the blade properly adjusted, tension the cleaner mechanism by rotating the torsion hub. Tighten the set bolt until it contact the torsion hub plus one quarter of a turn. Mark the position of the torsion hub and back plate for future adjustment. It is also recommended you mark the position of the blade support bar on the reaction arm for future reference. Run the belt for 15 minutes and inspect your work.